Hey, get everyone, it's Doc Joe here from Story Weaver Games, and welcome to the tutorial on city mapping using Pro Fantasy's City Designer 3 software for campaign cartographer. Now, before we start, please check out the City Builders checklist. It's a great resource for brainstorming your cities, and that will not only give you a good idea of what your city is going to be, but it will give you fantastic ideas for the adventures you can have in your city. Also, sketch out your city, really, please. It will save you a lot of time. In this tutorial, we're going to look at how to create the waterways, just the, just basically the coastlines of your city. So to do that, open up Campaign Cartographer, click on New Map icon right there. Yep, that's the one. And then select Cities from your map type and pick a predefined template. The reason I like to start with a predefined template, certainly for this tutorial, is it really gives you all the tools that you need right up front. And select City Designer 3 Style B, 2000 by 1600 feet. That will be a good one for this city. There we go. Now we've got a nice big blank piece of grass. Let's draw the coastlines on. And as you can see, our coastlines for our cove were mapped out briefly in our previous tutorial. I always suggest using the All City Drawings tool for this, and uh, there's the list of the drawing tools, but you can make it simpler for yourself by clicking on the preview. Let's start by clicking on the water default. To start your water, click outside of the map area, and then repeatedly click all around the map. You can see the lines clicking here. And I'm just going to speed that up. So we're going to draw our waterway all the way up to the top of the map. Then we're going to click just outside of the edge of the map twice to create a narrow waterway, which will be the river that runs through the center of our city. And again, we'll just quickly speed that up. And now we're going to open up to the, uh, the bay's mouth, click outside of the map area three times and bingo. We now have our map. And notice how it smoothly comes to the edges of our map. Now, that's not all we're going to do with our waterline. Next up, I'm going to show you how to adjust and fine tune that line. See you soon. Bye. Rightio, that's it. Now, don't forget to check out www.storyweaver.com for some great mapping resources. Just click on the master mapping menu and also check out some of the cool games that we publish as well. Keep mapping, keep learning, and keep sharing your wonderful creations.